the markings for an upper lid blepharoplasty. We have a delightful patient here who has redundant skin, a little excess muscle, and some fullness here that represents some fat. The first mark is exactly where the eyelid fold is, and that is between eight and 10 millimeters from the eyelashes. As you can see here, it's about, about 10 millimeters. That's perfect. So we will follow that natural line all the way across. And then ask our patient to gently open her eyes up. Now keep it there. And then we go all the way to the end of the fullness, what we call the deformity. And we note where the punctum is, close your eyes for a second, and we don't want to extend our incision past that. Then, once the lower line is made, we use a device called a fixation forcep to gather up the extra skin to be sure we don't take so much that causes the eye to be open after the case. We want them to have normal eyelid closure. We'll check it again over on the side. Oh yeah, that's good right there. And we'll check it again in the middle, in the center. That's good there, too. So those are the markings for an upper lid blepharoplasty. Now open your eyes up, and you can see there's going to be quite a significant removal, but it's really going to open her eyes up and just really take that tired look, give her that really energized, youthful, ready-to-go look. So here we go. Thank you. <laughs> 